many of you um, would be considered first generation college students, meaning your parents have not yet gone to college? Okay, so a lot of you. So some people think that puts you at a disadvantage. If your parents didn't go to college, you are less likely to go to college. I don't believe that. I think if you set your mind to it, you can be whatever you want to be. I truly believe that. Well, we had a group of um, nearly 90 students from Everman Independent School District here visiting as part of a college bound to get these high school students thinking about and believing that they are able to go to college. It was um, included a welcome and inspiration that, that this is doable and then a tour of campus and right now they're meeting with uh, people from admissions to um, learn just the nuts and bolts of, of getting admitted to college. I came from a family of 13 children. Um, my parents did not have a college degree. Uh, my parents couldn't help me go to college. I mean, once I lived at home till 18, and once I turned 18, I worked every summer, and I worked during the school year, and I put myself through college. So you don't have to come from a wealthy family. You don't have to come from a family whose parents went to college. But you can go to college, and it can change your life. I was already thinking about like going to college, but not really sure. And I'm really thinking about coming back and, and asking more questions. I used to think that this school is actually a really high price school, but now that I look at it, you could probably manage to get it, even though they say it's high price, you can still manage to probably get this. A lot of them want to choose TCU now, especially our uh, soon to be seniors. I heard some of them saying that they wanted to attend TCU and it was a nice campus, and some of them just want to go to college, period, now. You go as far as you can go in school. You do whatever you have to do to get there. And you always believe in yourself.